Match day 28, the Ishpian Premier Division sees the visit of league leaders Bishop Stortford to Hartstown Park to play Margate. The first chance of the game comes from Emmanuel Oki after Margate pinned Bishop Stortford backwards until Wood eventually lays the ball off to Oki who unleashes a venomous shot towards goal but it just goes over. First bit of defending for Margate is across from the right hand side which finds Charles in the box who just heads over. The next chance would come after the half an hour mark as Bishop Stortford win the aerial tussle in the midfield before Harris slides in Foxley whose shot is saved at the near post by Gennardo. With the clock ticking towards half time, Margate deal with a cross into the box before Barton picks out Roberts who executes a brilliant turn before trying to catch the keeper out from range but it ends up a routine stop for Giddon. Just moments after Roberts tried a spectacular effort, the first goal would come from Chris Harris after Christie failed to properly clear Akel Beer's ball across the six yard box and the ball ended up at Harris's feet and he lashed home a shot which left Denardo no chance of stopping it. A wonderful strike from Harris to break the deadlock. The next chance would come 13 minutes into the second half as a free kick from around 25 yards out was well struck but caught by Gennardo. Margate then had a free kick of their own four minutes later but Wood was unable to curl the ball in at the near post. Just a minute later Bishop Stortford failed to clear their lines with Margate winning the ball back high and Nathan Wood pulled the ball back for Greenhall who put probably the best chance of the game just over the bar. A Margate attack breaks down in the box and Bishop Stortford looked to counter but their efforts were thwarted by Christie on his Margate debut. Akal Beer dispossessed Oki in the Margate half to start a move that ends up with Foxley going for goal at a tight angle but misses the target. Into the last 10 minutes, Margate comes surging forward looking to snatch a late equaliser, but a cross from Odgerman is caught by Giddon. The last chance of Margate saw MacArthur have a one on one situation with Church, and he got to the byline only for his cutback to be smashed out of harm's way by the Bishop's Stalker defence. And that would be it at Hartstown Park. A spirited gate performance would unfortunately end in defeat at the hands of league leaders Bishop Stortford by a narrow one goal margin. Plenty of positives to take from the performance for Margate. <laughs>